3D modeling approaches based on sweeping hand input are immediate and intuitive. The problem with these approaches is that they are too uncontrollable for work that goes beyond sketching. Drawing on air is an interaction technique for more controllable 3D line drawing. It contains two integrated modes, one-handed drag drawing and two-handed tape drawing. In each mode, the artist explicitly controls the drawing direction. In drag drawing, the direction is set by towing around a virtual brush. In tape drawing, by moving the non-dominant hand. Line weight is adjusted by pushing an elastic controller or by pushing the pen against the force feedback provided by the Phantom. Both modes provide a backup and redraw feature that preserves the tangent of the curve. Both techniques have advantages for drawing certain types of lines. It is useful to smoothly transition between the two, even within a single line. Drawing on air is for controlled 3D line drawing. These examples have been limited in their use of depth because the monitor was put in monoscopic mode for filming. To obtain more sophisticated results, artists require head-tracked stereoscopic virtual reality. Drawing on air adds control to the immediacy and intuitiveness of hand-based input. This allows artists to move beyond gesture sketches and toward more challenging 3D illustrations.